Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 32, and this is war number three, and we're going up against an alliance called uh, Atike Latino. I don't know if I said that right. Sorry if I did not. But let's take a look at what they have on the defense for us. All right, so I take path three. Oh, look. Iron Warrior has already gone in. Nice. All right, so first is uh, Symbiote Supreme. And then we have um, Blade. Neither one of these are very difficult. And since he's already taken that first mini, I don't have to worry about bringing somebody for that mini. So uh, any of these, uh, either one of these can be taken by Warlock, Blade, I mean, um, Nick Fury. Um, let's see. I might have a different idea. Okay, so Doom. Spider-Man 2099 would be good for that one. Let's see, who's the boss? Ew, I hate fighting him. Um, all right, so then we've got... Cosmic Ghost Rider, we also have Stealth Spidey, and Sasquatch for that node. So Warlock is generally who I will choose for that node that Sasquatch is on. Uh, so I will bring Warlock. So really it just boils down to the rest of these. Um, Clairvoyant could handle both of those fights. Nick Fury could handle those. He wouldn't be good for that one, though. Hmm. So, Spider-Man 2099, Warlock, and maybe I'll bring my Hercules. Yeah. Hercules, Warlock, Spider-Man 2099. That seems to be a good uh, a good team this go around. Wish I could bring my six star, but he is in uh, Alliance Quest. But the five star uh, should be just fine. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Okay, uh, so we'll be back with the fighting. All right, we are back. And that's the team I decided to go in with. And I told one of my alliance mates, anytime you see me bringing in Spider-Man 2099, I'm eyeballing that boss. And we do get to fight the boss in this war. Uh, I actually went off in this war. But anyway, first fight is Symbiote Supreme. You see the team I brought in. Hercules, even though it's a five-star, more than capable of handling himself. So I'm going to go in with Hercules and just smack this symbiote supreme around. Okay, now I was thinking, all right, I know I don't want someone that has a ton of buffs, right? And the feats aren't really buffs or they're passives or what have you. So I'm thinking, all right, I'm pretty safe, okay? And so we're just, look at this, we're just tearing them up. Boom, just, just ripping him apart right but now he has an armor up and now i'm starting to take damage and because i did the special one boom did you see my health disappear just now that was a mistake on my part so with hercules if you fire off your special one and intercept like you saw me do i had those precision buffs now normally that's great because it ramps up his damage but against Symbiote Supreme, he nullified them and I took all that damage. That's what happened right there. Okay, so if you're using Hercules, you have to remember that. But I wasn't worried because, you know, I still have my immortality. So we're still good. Uh, I've gotten so many of these from uh, Kabam that, you know, I'm just using them whenever I feel like them. Okay, uh, feel like it. So next up is Blade. Not a hard defender. So again, a chance for me to ramp up 
my uh, Hercules a little bit. Got one feet there. Just look at this. Just ripping them, ripping them. Da 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 da. All right. And I think I can't remember if I went for an intercept here, because um, this is the last uh, last one I want to do. I don't like getting knocked down to get a feet there. There we go. There's the intercept. So I got an intercept and I got a knockdown when they weren't stunned. And those are the two feats that I'll carry over. So I can ramp them up a little bit. So we did that fight pretty simple, pretty easy. Now, as you saw earlier, he already took out that mini. And the middle already cleared. And I did not want to touch that mixed master. Now, the problem is that I wanted to take on that, um, I think it was Doom, with my Spider-Man 2099. Nobody was awake. And by the time that um, Professor X was cleared, they also cleared that Doom Mini. So I was like, okay, well, let's just keep going. And I, at this point in time, I had eaten my breakfast and I was feeling good. So we gonna ramp up a little bit more. All right, now that kind of surprised me. He dexed out of my um, heavy attack. Um, he's probably running limber and I was probably a little bit late uh, on the um, release of the heavy. But we're good. But you can see I'm losing health. I'm losing health, but I don't care. Boom! Look at that damage. Nasty. Just nasty. Whew. And this is the five-star Hercules. My six-star is in uh, Alliance uh, Quest. But five-star still does its job. All right, so now we've got uh, Stealth Suit Spidey. And I'm going to use Hercules again. No need uh, to um, try to use anybody else. Use another one of those heals. I've got like four of the Kabam um, packages that I haven't even claimed yet. So when I do claim them, I'm also going to have enough to get the um, uh, Unstoppable Colossus dupe. But I can wait. Okay, there's the uh, intercept. And boom, another special intercept. You see, I have the uh, precisions. And just look at that. Just look at the damage. Just crazy. Boop, right in the head. <laughs> I was just waiting for him. He was going crazy. I was like, yeah, do all that stuff. Fire your special. Do what you want to do. I'll wait and then kicked him in the head. So now, next up is this Sasquatch. Now, I did not want to take this fight lightly because Sasquatch has a lot of health. And of course, we have the unstoppable armor, all that good stuff. So I'm like, all right, I'm gonna bring in Warlock, of course, but we're gonna, we're gonna uh, uh, boost him up a little bit, okay? So, you know, not a big boost. It's good. We still have the 15% boost on. I had put that on earlier, um, I think, in a AQ. But we've got a tech boost, a uh, tech power boost. That's going to be nice. And then I put on a little small tech boost. And the only thing left so that I can ignore the node somewhat is an advanced power boost. So I'm guaranteed to get to a special uh, two without uh, needing to get hit a lot to get there. Okay, so the first thing I wanna do is parry, fail that parry, but whatever, um, and get enough to get him infected so that he does not heal. All right, there we go. Now I wanna just get to my special two. Keep parrying to keep those uh, infections up. So look at that, look at that damage. I was like, yeah, buddy. Okay, so we just, we're going. Now, I'm not paying attention to his um, wrath charges or whatever they're called. Boom. 
Suddenly he got wrath right in the middle and started hitting me. I'm like, really? So I countered that with my own special too. It's like, nah, you ain't gonna do that to me. Now I'm just gonna wait that out. Mm hmm. Now he don't got no more wrath. Now I'm coming back. Yeah, no healing for you, nothing. And look at this, another special two. Done, done and done. So we're on a roll at this point, okay? <clears throat> on a roll. Love Warlock. And on that note, especially, he is just a beast. There's some fights I don't wanna take on that node, but for that fight, for, for most fights, it's good. Now I get here to Mini Boss Island and I look and I see, wait a minute, they've cleared the right side, like I said they usually do, but Korg still got some health on him. Hmm. And he's got no health and I'm like, okay, he still has two attack bonuses remaining. Hmm. Let's do it. Let's get that uh, Korg. Now, I remember going for Havoc. Havoc was my Korg counter. But before that, I used to just brute force it with Corvus. You know, I did not try to do light intercepts or anything like that because I knew that he was immortal. Well, guess what? Same thing with Hercules. So I ain't worried about trying to do light intercepts. Okay? Just, just go in. Boom. See? Took some damage. I don't care. And then I do light, 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 light afterwards okay boom take that initial light 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 now, now we've shattered the shield and i noticed that he got some power that's fine boom i wanted to get that intercept in while his shield was down all right but now he's real close to a special three i don't want the special three okay here we go and now we're gonna do the same thing we did earlier you know don't worry about the damage okay doom 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 Yes, intercept, I mean, uh, evading that special one. All right, now here we go with the light, light, light. The, the, the uh, rock shield is down and boom, 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 and we're done. And you will notice that even though I have the immortality as a safety net, I haven't used one yet. So when people ask, is Hercules good even if he's not awakened? Yes, he is. He is really good. All right. Now, this fight pissed me off. I'm not going to lie. I got upset over this fight. So, improved power gain. Yep. Special two bias. Okay. All right. So, I'm like, all right. I still got my boosts for the um, uh, tech, right? So, I'm like, you know what? Let's go in there with um, Warlock, heal him up. Also, just to make things a little bit extra safe, let's put on a vulnerability boost. That way I can just go ham, push him to a special three if I want to. And I got three times I can do that. And then I just started getting hit. And I was like, what was that? I was like, what just happened there? It's like, all right, whatever. So I'm going, you know, got him uh, infected. We're good, we're good. Okay. All right, and then boom, boom, unblockable. I was like, okay, that's not good. So I hit him with that, but um, I think it doesn't work against Cosmics. And then special two, unblockable again. I'm like, wow. Look at it, look at the stacks. And he's back at a special two. Do -do -do. Done. Just tore me up. I was like, oh my goodness. Yeah, and I don't think the um, tech uh, power boost works against Cosmics, is what that is. So I didn't get any back. I got one special two off. That was it. And I was like, no, 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 no. We're not going out like that. We're going back in there. That's one thing I hate. I said, no, not going to just go down like that. He is not going to live to tell the tale of what he did to my warlock. Not happening. So I went back in there 
to give him a little Herculean beatdown. All right, so now I'm just like, let's go. I don't even care. Let's do this. Look at the damage. Look at the damage, y'all. I'm like, whatever. All right, you want to do that? Boom, let's just keep going. Hit him with it. Boom, boom. Pushed him to a special three. I don't care. I got that invulnerability boost still on. Let's go. Nope, no damage. Nope, didn't feel it. Nope, that don't hurt. Yep, yep. All that means nothing. Nothing. Boom. Now I'm going to hold my special three just in case he gets to another special three. Because then I'll get an indestructible. But, doo -doo 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 -doo. there's my indestructibles. But guess what? Boom, boom. And he's down. And that was Hercules. And I didn't trigger my immortality. Just saying. He is still a beast. All right. So now, this fight is the boss fight. Spider-Man 2099 against Super Scroll. I'll talk to you guys a little bit more about the fight afterwards. Okay? So for now, it was a sloppy fight, but enjoy.
All right. So as I told you before, I was going to talk to you a little bit about the fight after the fight. Very sloppy. This was the first time I've ever fought Super Scroll on that boss node. So first thing caught me by surprise. He kept going unstoppable. And I was like, wait, what? I was like, okay, okay. I know how to handle unstoppables. So I built up to a special three. Fired that off. Got a slow. Said, okay, good. Now we should be good. He kept going unstoppable. I'm like, wait, I thought slow was supposed to stop that. So I'm like, okay, we got to just kind of figure this out on the fly. And you can see how many times I got hit. But look at my health. I got hit a lot of times, but because of that damage reduction, I wasn't taking a lot of damage. So even though I played poorly my first time against him, I still got the solo. Spider-Man 2099 is a beast boss killer, okay? Definitely one of the top boss killers in the game for Alliance War. All right, so we're going to have a brief intermission. And as you can see, I went off in this war. Uh, we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. And not only that, I got MVP. Yes, I did. Uh, shout out to Anoid and Emperor Dean, who also got MVP. Awesome, awesome effort on everyone's part. We did that thing. Uh, when I took on that boss, uh, when I actually when I started fighting that last stretch, I looked to see where we were in terms of kills, and we were actually tied on kills. We were a little further ahead than they were. So I went through, I died once, um, and that's what uh, tied us up. Uh, my first death tied us up. And so I was like, okay, if everybody pulls together, we got it. And they weren't done yet either. They got a lot more deaths as well. So we were able to pull it out. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.